All right, today's video, we're gonna take our Jack Brooks 62 caliber, the 20 gauge smooth bore, and we're gonna run a test to see if 1F will outperform 2F or the other way around in a simple head-to-head -head competition. So out at 25 yards, I've got a paper plate, just a standard size 12 inch paper plate. And I'm going to shoot 65 grains of 1F um, with mm, one and an eighth ounce of shot over the top. And I'll shoot that three times, get an average, and then we'll do 2F, Swiss 2F, the same way. And just see if there's a difference between the 1F performance, 2F performance. And what we'll do, 65 grains and then a nitro card soaked in lube, soaked in melted lube nitro card, and then our shot, and then an overshot card. So that's it. So let's give it a try. And one and an eighth ounce of number five shot, lead shot. Let's go take a look. All right, so that's, it's not a real dense pattern, but it's 38 shot. So we are firing the Swiss 2F out of the uh, horn first, and then we'll hire, fire the, uh, the 1F in comparison. All right, a little better pattern, 41 shot. So 39 and 41. All right, our third and final shot with the uh, Swiss 2F. Go take a look. And 41 on this one as well. So I call that an average of 40 shot in the uh, paper plate. So let's switch to the uh, Swiss 1F, see if anything happens. Uh, shoots in 1F, FG, shoots it. And if you've never seen 1F before, Pretty big stuff. Twenty seven. So not as good. Let's try it again. Sixteen. So that's super interesting. I didn't expect that. I'll run this again on a full uh, um, shotgun board, you know, with the three foot ring, and just make sure my point of impact hadn't shifted, you know, six inches low or whatever with that uh, with that powder charge, but. I don't think so, you know, 25 yards. I mean, it could, but I, I don't think so. So quick little test, you know, I've had different results in my 12 bore, just the opposite. So this one is gonna need some more testing, but it certainly looks like the Jack Brooks trade gun doesn't like 1F. So very interesting. We'll see you next time, bye.